Hello everyone and welcome to another computer software is your friend tutorial. Now Microsoft has come out with their brand new Windows 8 which features a user face overhaul and a lot of new apps to get things that you used to do on the desktop done. Now what happens if you don't like these new apps and you prefer to do things on the desktop? Well, currently these full screen apps are defaults, which means that if you double click on the file, they will open with their default, which is the Metro app. But you want to use a different app on the desktop. Well, the solution is very, um, very simple. You just go to defaults, just search for defaults. All I had to type was DFA and you'll get default programs and you can basically from here choose your default programs and it will load so now Internet Explorer is you can set the default so essentially what you would do here is say that you wanted to replace Adobe Reader with Adobe Reader uh, with, with the PDF reader with Adobe Reader you would go to Adobe Reader I don't have it installed but you would click set this program as default so for example let's say that you're dealing with pictures there is a photos app but you prefer to use the the photo viewer so you just make this one as the default and now uh, if we find a picture in here somewhere um, So now let's say that we have uh, this picture here. It's going to open in Photo Viewer instead of in the full screen viewer. Now, of course, um, over here you can see that there are other programs uh, made to do that task as well. Now, say that you wanted to use the Photos app instead of the Photo Viewer you would click set this um, program as the default and you would go back and search for that JPEG again and essentially you would click on it and it would open in the photos app which would open it in full screen and you would right click and you can set it as the lock screen, the app tile or the app background and you can delete it as well not many options but that's what they give you you can zoom in and zoom out using the small buttons on the bottom right corner so that's pretty much it when it comes to file defaults um, same thing applies with videos um, and this kind of thing so let me know in the comments below uh, are you going to be keeping the Windows defaults with their new apps or are you going to be going back to the desktop customs that you used to use in Windows 7 and previous versions of Windows let me know if you like this video and our other videos and our content in general the subscribe button is above and the social media stuff is in the description below. If there's anything you want me to review, if there's anything you want me to show you in Windows 8 or in anything else, join me in social media and let me know. I'm always uh, keeping my eyes open to see if someone wants something. And of course, I'll do my very best uh, to get that for them. So until the next video, this has been another computer software is your friend tutorial.